everyone, I'm Christopher Walker, and today we're going to be talking about some of the formatting options that you have when composing an email. So first, when you get into your Gmail, you're going to want to go over and in the top left corner, click the Compose button, and that's going to open up your email window. Um, you want to put in who it's to, the subject, and then... Um, you know, write your text that you want to include in the email. I already have some done up that I'm going to paste in there. Now, this is looking um, very plain and ordinary. So this is where formatting options come in handy. If you go down to the bottom of the email window and click on the A with the underline. Um, it's the formatting options section. That's going to open up this nice little row for you right here. So what you're able to do is you can change the font style, um, you can change the size. Gmail gives you some options um, already there for you, so then you don't have to go through and click different you know, numbers of the sizes. It gives you some nice options. You can bold something, so if you highlight and click the bold button, that will bold those words for you. You can italicize, um, so if you highlight again, click the italicize. Uh, if you want to underline, highlight, click the U with the uh, line underneath it. You also have the option to change colors. Um, and you have two options within here, and that's the background color. So that's going to change what it looks like behind the writing. Um, and then if you click over back down there again, you can also change the text color. So what the actual letters look like. So if I wanted them to be bright pink, I could do that. Um, you can also decide how you want your email um, words to be aligned. So if I wanted this whole section um, to be aligned towards the middle, it would all center right there in the middle, or I could pick towards the right. Um, it's auto defaulted though to the left, um, like normal books would be. You can also add in um, bullet points, both number and um, just the regular bulleted list. And then you do have more options here. So you can indent less, indent more. Um, you can add in quotes. Um, you can strike through something. So if you click that, it's going to you know, mark it out. Almost looks like it's crossed out. And then you also have the option to remove all formatting. So if I click that, it's going to go back to the original. So that's how you add um, some formatting options to your email. I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial. Mm -hmm.